and welcome back to another video. Ah. As you can see, shut up. As you can see, today we are playing The Sims 4. That's why Pumpkin looks so beautiful. What a fox. I had intended to play this a little earlier than I'm currently playing it, but uh, I got the illness. Yes. The illness. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So I got the Cottage Living expansion pack for The Sims. I've played The Sims for, well, most of my life, really. <laughs> so uh, I know a thing or two about Sims and uh, custom content and all that stuff. So basically, all I've done is that uh, I've made Pumpkin and she's in this lovely cardigan, which is part of the Cottage Living expansion pack. I mean, it isn't very flattering, I'll be honest. It's a little bit unshapely, but you know, whatever, it doesn't matter. She's got dem thighs. Oh, baby. And also I found this beautiful uh, head scarf, which oh. is like pretty much identical to the one in game. And I, I made her little freckles. So I, I got to try and make her look as accurate as I could. You can see she is an animal enthusiast. She loves the outdoors. And she is clumsy because, you know, clumsy. So I'm gonna put her on uh -huh. the farm. Shut up, pumpkin. And we're going to make her do the farm living life. But before I get on to that, I've also been making the other characters. So this is Freya. Isn't she lovely? She's so lovely. I, uh, I gave her actual Freya's eyes as well. She is the leader of the pack. She is neat, she is self-assured, and she is a snob. And then we have Eric, who looks adorable. Look at his little puffy clothes. <laughs> I've also put him in one of the, the new jumpers from the new expansion. I made him want to be a chef because in my game he owns the cafe. Now move on to Zell. Baby boy, he looks darling. Darling. I tried to give him his face thing. <laughs> I mean, it kind of works. I mean, from afar away, it's like, yeah, that's Zell. Close up, it's like, you've spilt chocolate on your face, mate. But it's fine. Tangy, who is one of my favorites. As soon as I saw this dress that came with Cottage Living, I was like, yes. Moving on to Fauna. And I am crushing on her. Look at how gorgeous she is. I gave her like a little Vaughn spots on her face. She's got the lovely brown eyes. She's creative. She's a bookworm. She's good. And then we go on to my, my girl, Gail. <laughs> Oh goodness. <laughs> exactly. Uh, I gave her like the pink eyeshadow, gave her her little heart thing on her nose. Kind of works. Oh. She's got the mega high heels on because my Gail is a little bit of a one, as you can see by the fact that I've made her traits a serial romantic. She is non committal. She is a dance machine because she loves to party. What's wrong, Gail? Too many late nights with all the boys on the island finally catching up to you. I've also given her a second outfit of uh, this. <laughs> it's Gail. I feel like this is what my girl would wear if she had the chance. Make them boys go loco. My baby boy Bam. Isn't he cute? Ah. <laughs> okay. So I've given him his little nose freckles and I've put him in these short shorts because reasons. And then I have the villagers who are currently no longer with us, but I wanted to include them anyway. So we Ooh. have Fang. We have Deirdre, who I'm still searching for. Yeah, this jump up was one that came with the country living, but they didn't have it in the right color, but the pattern was so perfect that I was like, well, I have to try and edit it so it looks a little bit more like Deirdre's jumper, because why not? Obviously, uh, that's not a feature in normal Sims, if, if you didn't know. I have the Sims 4 Studio, which is basically a program which allows you to make uh, custom content. And then we have Queen Becky over here with the tiniest, teeniest waist. Wow, Becky. Ah. Oh yeah, I gave her yellow teeth, I forgot. <laughs> because it's her beak. She's mean, she's a music lover, and she's jealous because ugh, Becky. And then lastly, we have my boy mm. Sherb, who isn't really my boy, but we're pretending he is, okay? He is lazy, he is cheerful, and he is good. All the best qualities in the man. I now want to make some more and show you the process of me making some. So obviously, you'll notice I haven't done Raymond, and I haven't done... Who's the other one? Kid! Oh, that's the one. Sorry, baby. I'm gonna do kids first, just because I have Sherp here. So I'm basically gonna just clone this sim. I'll speed it up, and I will show you the yeah. finished result. Me, oh, me, me, oh, me, oh, me, oh, me, oh, me, ah. Oh, me, 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 oh, me
みおみなみなおおみえなみなおおなみなおみなおおみおみおみおおみおみおみおおみおくえみくえおおみおくえみなおみな Okay, so here he is. I decided to give him these gloves just because I feel like his、uh, character has like yellow little feet. I'm not sure. I didn't do this for any of the others. I just thought about doing it just the second. If you guys think this looks ridiculous and he looks like he's about to go do some gardening, then、uh, I'll get rid of it. Now, let's move on to his personality. I don't really know him that well. He's only just moved in, but from what I know of him, he seems to be a bit of a playboy. He's got his bachelor pad, so I think he's interested in love. I mean, that works for me. Ah, bluebish. <laughs> yeah, bluebish. I know. I mean, those gloves are doing it for me. I don't know about anyone else. Look at him. He's so prepared to go and do the dishes. Who's next but our darling Raymond? Now, me, oh, me, now. Que, que, me, now, oh. This is the part where I completely messed up Raymond's face, so. Enjoy that. Oh my god! Why is it whenever I do Raymond in these things, I always make him look so bad? Why do you look like a pest dispenser? And also, I realized that the main thing about Raymond is, you know, he has heterochromia. So I'm gonna have to get that for next time. His fringe doesn't even go the right way. Ah.、Uh, why does your chin look like that? Everyone else looks great. Why do you look the way you do? Why are you the way that you are? Can I not fix this? Oh, I've made it worse. Oh, God. Oh, my God! There he is. Beautiful. Obviously, self absorbed. Chonker. Tish Narentu. Did you just call me a chonker? How dare you, sir? I can easily make you one. You just have to say the word. Done. It's only taken us an hour. It's fine. And here we are in the game. Pumpkin, why do you look so sad? Also, why are your arms melding into your leg? This is so unflattering. Oh, and she's off. You better not be going swimming. Don't tell me what to do. Oh, okay, well, she's just going to float there for a second. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go visit my friends over at their lot and see how they're doing. Okay. Oh, great. We show up and Gail's here to see me in my swimming costume. Girl, change out of that. Oh, I need the toilet. I forgot that the Sims, you, you were required to actually survive. Yeah, 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 girl, I know. You need a pee. We haven't even, like, greeted everyone. We're just hobbling straight in to go to the toilet. Eric's not leaving! Seriously, I'm trying to pee in here. Zell's giving me a look. Oh my goodness. He's just staring at me. Oh, never mind. Of course, these two would be chatting to each other. They're the couple. I'm gonna try and befriend Bam. Tell him a funny story. Befriend him. Compliment his legs. Um, Zell, honey, you wanna, like, get out of my face? Why am I talking to his back? Can I ask him about his career? What does he do? Zell! Why are you just walking through corner like that? <laughs> That was the most awkward laugh I've ever heard. Uh, excuse me, sir, you can't be looking at my skirt like that. Okay, well, I'm hungry. Is anybody gonna cook me food? You guys are bad hosts. I put my clothes in the fridge. Oh, it's just like Animal Crossing. Zoomers food delivery. I want Zoomers. Should we order some apples? I don't want an avocado. Yeah, basil's good. A bottle of milk, that should be useful. An egg. Wow! We're just gonna order loads of food. Let's order some groceries so we can cook things. I have no idea what I'm doing. No, you're not going to bed. There's a man at the door. You must accept the delivery. Excuse me, sir. Come back with my vegetables. Can I cook something? I can make a fruit salad. And that's it. 
Fabulous. Okay, well, I guess that's a hearty meal. I should have just ordered a pizza. Looks delicious. I can't wait to eat it. Eat your salad. Hey everyone, it's salad. Delicious? Don't mind the plants coming through the wall, that's normal. Girl, run. You need to hug him. I mean, I kind of smell, so he might be repulsed. Oh god, we're dripping. We're wet. You have an umbrella and you're not letting me under it. Where is he going? Come back. Why have you left? Let's go home. This is getting nowhere. So I think what I'm gonna try and do, I'm going to try and play as Bam or someone and bite Pumpkin into the household. This is like an allotment or something. Wait, what? This is not a double bed. I am not sleeping in it. What's that? I just heard a weird noise. What are you holding there, sir? Oh, apparently it's me. Bring your luckiest, cluckiest chicken to the cup. We don't have chickens. I wanna get some chickens. Oh God, it's Becky. She heard me talking about chickens and then she arrived. Where is she? Hey, Becky, would you like this lump of clay? Oh, she doesn't care. She just walks away. Come on, let's go home and um, get some chickens or something. I've never seen anybody run quite like this. We do seem to have a shed and we have a chicken coop. Let's purchase some chickens. Should we get some cows or I, I guess, yeah, let's get some, purchase some animals. <gasps> we can get a beige llama. Yes, we're getting llamas. Let's invite me over. Invite to hang out. <gasps> well, obviously we have to get loads of these. And, and I guess we'll get some watermelon and, and mushrooms. Love me some mushrooms, but mostly pumpkins. Plant them, plant them everywhere. Is pumpkin here? Am I in the house? Can I ask you to move in? Freya just materialised out of nowhere. Gail trying her hardest to be involved in the conversation when we're not even talking to her. He's like, mm, ladies, care to see my dance move? Bam, do you think that this is seductive? Do you think that this is impressing us? We're not even looking at you. Where are you going? Are you following Freya upstairs? Oh, sorry, Tangy, didn't mean to. Sure, Jan. Have a deep conversation. Oh my god, I think we have animals. Call over beige llama. Okay, well, we'll wait for the morning. But yes, this is great. Yes, I knew there was an option to do it. In you come, girl. Oh, look at all the money she's brought with her. We're balling now. And now she lives with them. Yes. Unfortunately, uh, this house does not have enough beds. So we're going to have to share or uh, make very good friends with other people. Go to bed. Night, night. Why is time not going faster? <laughs> what the hell is going on? Oh my god, what just happened? I think our chickens just got killed by foxes. Oh my god! He's got an egg? No, Eric, I give it back. How dare he? No! Now I'm sad. God damn it, Casey! Watch him, ask him not to steal. Oh, great. There's a chicken! She's unhappy. Or well, he's unhappy, sorry, because he's starving. Bam, feed your chickens. I don't know why I'm assigning Bam as the chicken feeder. It should have been me. Floney. Floney, come on. Come on, Floney. Can I name them? Apple? Oh no, your name is Floney. Bam said it was. Eggy? That's a lame one. No, this is going to be Becky. And this is Floney. Oh my goodness. Bye. Dude, you need to leave. I don't care that you're hungry. What the fuck, thing? Hey, llama, llama. You look filthy. What's wrong with you? Tina? Tina, you fat lard. Come get some dinner. No, this is feud. You need a friend. You can't just have one llama. You have to have more than one. You'd be sad if you don't have more than one. This is llama house. <laughs> oh my god, that was so realistic. Yeah. Yeah. That is less realistic. No llama would appreciate yeah. this. Gail, put some clothes on. My goodness. Gonna get us demonetized. What did I just do? I just grabbed some poop out of the uh, chicken shed. And now I'm bringing it into the house. Oh, that's sanitary. I better not be cooking it. Eric, what are you doing? I told you to plant some vegetables. Water your plants. Do I still have all my food in my inventory or is it like- Nope. So I bought all that food for no reason. Fab. Okay, we're ordering pizza. It's a bunny. Not now, Becky. I don't want to talk to you. What's his name? What's his name? Shut. No. You can't do that to me. That's quite sad. Pumpkin, come and come and discuss hopping techniques with Sherlock. Oh, somebody grab the pizza. It's here. Take the pizza. Who the hell's this running into my house? Why is he in my house? <laughs> Insult fluffiness. No. Pet him. He's not liking us. She's about to stand on him. Bam, this is not the time for exercising. Here, have some garlic. Oh, he liked the garlic. 
That's good. Let's ask him for gardening help, sure. Yes, he has agreed to help. We have a rabbit helping us garden now. I love him. You can stay the hell away, sir. Is his mouth okay? Oh my god, another fox. Debate the uselessness of rabbits. I can't read. Were they right there? I don't think so. Gail's feeling flirty. Of course she is. What is going on over here? I think they like each other. <laughs> Ooh. Eric, you just broke the toilet! Changi, come here! I didn't think that you'd be great at repairing toilets. You've got small arms. You'd be perfect for getting around the U-bend. Oh gosh, it's just walking on Eric in the bath. Oh my god, look at me. I smell and I need to pee. And yet still I am committed to my garden. She's gonna wet herself. Well, if you wet yourself in the garden, you're gonna fertilize the plants. Think of it that way. Look, babies. Oh, I thought it said give chicken nugget advice. That was like, that's a really horrible name to call it. Who would call their their baby chick chicken nugget? It's cruel. Yumbara. Did you just say Bambara? I have a carrot Ayala. for you. I don't really. It's all lies. Oh, Gail, okay. what are you doing? Are you going to offer him help with his errands? She's like, I'll help you. you can do whatever you want. I've been meaning to go see my friends, but I'm busy. You go and see them. You know, people you've never met. Strangers. Go and see how they are. He's like, yeah, Fauna, you could help me, you know. She's like, no, no, you, you do a great job by yourself. Gail, nobody's watching you. Booty, booty. Booty, booty. I'm gonna end it there for today. Next time we will try and uh, explore a bit of the village and meet the villagers. I'm having a good time just getting into grips with all the different things that this game has. So for now, I will say goodbye, but I hope that you've enjoyed and if you wanna see more of The Sims, then let me know down below. I will see you in the next video. Dag dag, uh, I mean, bye bye <laughs>